The ultimate material for implant system sealing, the oral environment is ideal for bacteria and fungi. Without a proper seal, the abutment screw hole becomes contaminated, causing peri-implantitis, which can lead to implant loss. Every dental implant professional is familiar with the foul smell after opening the assembled implant abutment structure, for example, after replacing the healing cap with an abutment. The reason is bacterial colonies. The implant gets contaminated with germs from the oral cavity immediately after the insertion. Bacteria growth starts the moment after locking the fixation screw. Up to 80% of implants present mucositis symptoms confined to the soft tissue around the implant. It is characterized by redness, swelling, and bleeding on probing. The mucositis around implants, combined with low adherence to oral hygiene protocol, dramatically increases the risk of peri-implantitis. There will always be a micro gap at the implant abutment junction. This gap grows when forces are applied, like chewing. When the implant and abutment system stay under load, they move slightly, creating a suction effect that draws saliva through the micro gap into the implant and abutment channel. Bacteria within the saliva are also drawn inside. While aerobic bacteria may not survive, anaerobic bacteria stay inside and multiply. This continuous process causes the reinfection of peri-implant tissue through the gaps, leading to an ongoing cycle. These colonies of bacteria infect the filler material inside the abutment and occupy a bigger volume than the deepest possible periodontal pocket. Mechanical debridement and professional removal of plaque and tartar may lead to visible improvement, but it has been proven ineffective and inefficient in treating peri-implantitis since it does not eliminate the bacteria within the implant system. Until today, dentists were using any sort of materials to fill the screw tunnel of the abutment, such as wax, cotton pellets, gutta percha, Teflon plumber tape, and this is only a partial list. Wax is an unstable material that might dissolve. Cotton promotes bacterial growth. Gutta percha, or composite, can present a challenge when maintenance is required as they are difficult to remove. Teflon is proven to be susceptible to leakage and can also accumulate bacteria. Silflow is an FDA-approved medical device based on a light-curing silicone matrix. It was created for elevating the protocols and achieving a perfectly hermetic seal of the screw channel. This dramatically reduces the percentage of anaerobic bacteria inside the implant and protects the screw entrance. The reduction of bacteria contamination inside the implant preserves surrounding soft tissue from inflammatory processes and helps reduce the risk of the insurgence of peri-implantitis. With Silflow, you get a hermetic seal in one step, one layer, without using additional cumbersome and ineffective methods. It has great flowability and can be applied to any shape and size of screw-retained and temporary abutment channel. After curing, the material expands, achieving a hermetic seal. The removal is easy and fast as well with only one sill flow tool necessary for the procedure. It comes out in one piece, as the material maintains its elasticity for a prolonged period. The reduction of bacteria contamination inside the implant preserves surrounding soft tissue from inflammatory processes and helps reduce the risk of the insurgence of peri-implantitis. Sill flow provides three main benefits. One, it helps to promote healthier tissues in the implant area resulting in pink gums, contained bone loss, and no bad smell. Two, it simplifies the work protocol while eliminating one of the hardest to control causes of peri-implantitis. Three, it helps to prevent screw loosening while keeping the implant screw channels clean and safe from bacteria. 